Alex Thorne moves that into the middle. Colicchio to the outside. Mott into the end zone and an easy catch and a score for Greg Martin. Mott finds Pollard. James Pollard sends that back. All the way down. Big defensive play there. All the way down. Nice play there to keep it alive. Armstrong into the end zone. And the rush have tied it up. Hannah fell. Gamire gets that one. For Wilkie Lewis, for James Lewis. James Lewis on the forehand, looking into the end zone. Guess who's got it? Barbieri! Completely dispelled any kind of trepidation in that regard thus far. Absolutely, the statistics really that have been plaguing the rush so far in this uh, in this season have not been doing so in this game. And as we see an, another goal. There was an easy catch for James Pollard. James Lewis for Brother Wilkie. Little flick inside once again. O'Donnell looking deep. James Lewis has it, the disc setting up and James Lewis comes down with it. Adam O'Donnell breaking. We'll begin this next possession. Camire has O'Donnell. Camire looking deep for Barbieri. Not even a challenge for Turner. Turner moves that back. McLean had a great defensive play there by Jordan Ryan to break it up. Martin. Thorne for Colicchio, or yeah, it's Colicchio into the end zone. Martin comes down with it. And this just his sixth game of the season. O'Donnell finds Lewis. Lewis looking into the end zone. Disc hangs up. And James Lewis comes down with it, brother to brother. Now, into the hands of Martin. And a great catch, great play to keep it alive. All the way down, Pollard picks it up. Despite the best effort from Mike McKenzie, James Pollard gives the Philadelphia... Lewis finds Barbieri. Barbieri had Camire looking downfield. Here's the pass. And Camire grabs it. Out of midair. Right in front of Matt Hanna. And we're tied once again, Luke Camire. I think I might have heard Luke Camire with a little and one scream on that one. Really taking the taking the hit, making the play. I love to see when you have those connections that you don't necessarily expect from, you know, Ty Barbieri throwing it deep to Luke Camire. We would generally see that season. The opening pull of the second half, we're underway. And there's a drop in the end zone. Little flick into the hands of Mike Campanella. And the second half is underway with a Toronto mistake and Philadelphia cashing in. Slips, was able to grab the disc before he touched down. Lewis into the end zone. Oh, and what a grab! Griffin McKee, his second of the game, and Toronto ties it again. Amazing focus from Griffin McKee there. reaching McKee for Camire. Camire into the end zone, looking for Barbieri, can't come up with it. When, you know, there's multiple options, multiple threats to score or, or make that assist there. Uh, that That's the sign of, you know, an, an offense that is running as a, a great unit. Mark Sands into the end zone. Jeff Bevan, Robinson with it now. Finds Stonehouse. Stonehouse looking into the end zone for Reese. Too good and a nice defensive play there. Matt Hanna going up to bat it away. Couldn't get him the disc. Little flip inside. It's Eric Whitmer. Whitmer goes to the forehand. Flips it to Hanna. Hanna into the end zone looking for Trefillis and he gets it. Here's McKenzie. Throws that one down and off the turf. Right off the turf, Phil Turner, what a grab. And then he sends it up the field. 
Here's McLean. Back for Turner. Turner back into the middle. James Carpreez. Far side, Calvin Wang. McKenzie into the end zone. James Carpreez has it. Can't get it at once. They can get it. Colicchio breaking. They couldn't get him the disc. This time, ends up Sean Mott. Throws that one in. Pollard comes down with it. James Pollard finding the open spot in the end. Full indication that these players are into this. And there's the defense. Is that a Callahan? No. Yes, it is. K -k 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 Callahan. Eric Nardelli. What a play. Absolutely locking down Luke Camiri in the handler space there. That is going to be a little bit of a momentum blow for the rush here as the Phoenix open up a three goal lead. We'll see how they're able to mentally bounce back from this. Looks like they're sending just about the same line out there. Everybody continues to move. Cutters finding the open spot. Here's O'Donnell. O'Donnell puts the hammer down. And <laughs> Ty Barbieri scores again. Leaving the rush after next week to play for Team Canada's National U24 team and the disc sitting up in the air and Colicchio. Great position to make that D. Unfortunate that uh, the contact did occur. Here's Pollard into the end zone. Guess who got it? Greg Martin. Luke Camire finds James Lewis. Lewis for brother Wilkie. Looking deep, and Griffin McKee's got it! Sean Mott. Trisolini. Oscar Stowe, oh, what a great defensive play there! Left to go. Camire. Into the end zone, Stonehouse has it! Oscar Stonehouse, injured. A couple of minutes ago, still favoring that. Trisolini looking deep. Pollard trying to run under it. And he comes down with it. James Pollard. James Lewis. James Lewis throws that one into the end zone. And it's a defensive play by Thorne. Justin Keller. Moves that one up. Long pull, looking for Kalikio. No, it's Hannah and he's got it. Just beyond the reach of James Lewis and Matt Hanna. Restores the three goal advantage with 351 remaining in this fourth quarter. But eight goals, we're going to have to do our homework, folks, and determine whether or not that is indeed a Toronto Rush record for most goals in a game. Time winds down, and this one in the books, Philadelphia. Now three and four with a 27-23 victory over the Toronto Rush. Now two and four in the Eastern Division of the AUDL.